Hi, I'm Rochelle and this is Kate. Today we're going to unpack what's in the multiple boxes of the Tablet Robotics Kit. The kit comes with three big cases and one smaller case. One case houses 12 dashbots and their charging stations. And it also includes 12 blue bots, the two hexagonal shaped charging stations and the blue bot mats. There are also 12 Lego connectors that come with the dashbots. In another case, there will be the iPads. They store safely in these slots. The iPads come with another two 10 port charging stations. Make sure you charge the iPads before or after each use. The iPads in the Tablet Robotics Kit come with all apps required for Dash, Bluebots and Spike Essentials already installed. A fresh change to the kit is the removal of the LEGO WeDo 2.0 and the addition of LEGO Spike Essentials. LEGO Spike Essentials include more intelligent hardware components and covers a broader age group. The new kit is recommended for years one to six. For an older target audience, Spike Essentials Big Brother Spike Prime can be borrowed as part of the STEM T4L Inventor Robotics Kit. The sensors, motors and app for the Spike Prime work with Spike Essentials and vice versa. The Tablet Robotics Kits now come with 12 Spike Essential tubs in two large travel cases. Each tub comes with an elastic band around the lid to secure the pieces. Spike Essentials comes with another 10 port charger for charging the LEGO Technic small hubs. These use micro USB cables. You can adapt many we do lessons to suit Spike Essentials kits. Now that's a lot of equipment for you to explore and use in your classrooms. A quick note on the iPads. Remember they are managed by the STEM team. Any problems, request support at this link. If you need support with any of this equipment, you can head to the stem.t4l learning library. It is best not to have all the equipment in one classroom and not use it all in one hit. You want to spend some time with each component. To get the most out of the kit and to try and encourage more teachers to use the equipment, divide the gear up across multiple stages and classes and then rotating the gear across the school within the time that you have borrowed it. The kits are really heavy. They're on wheels make sure to use them, and not lift the kits by yourself. At the end of your loan, make sure you do the right thing by following the checklist for the next school receiving the kit. We hope you have a lot of fun with the Tablet Robotics Kit and are able to use them effectively in your classrooms. We can't wait to see what you innovate and create within your teaching and learning programs. Please share your successes or questions on the Yammer and Facebook STEM communities.